sometimes in the summer, I think like, okay, Friday afternoons, people are gone golfing. I mean, people are just not around. They don't answer the phone, even if you try calling. So obviously I try to do my calls before noon on a Friday, but sometimes I've gotten really lucky calling somebody on a Friday afternoon. Yeah, and you're gonna get even more lucky now because here's the thing, I'm giving you permission, Peggy. That's garbage. We're not having that rule. If you're in a spot where you can call them, you're gonna call them because guess what, Peggy? Even if they're golfing, they're not gonna be offended. Okay, worst, 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 worst case scenario. This, by the way, very unlikely that this is gonna happen. I'm sorry, I wish this happened because it meant that everybody takes our calls. But worst case scenario, they, op they answer their phone on the golf course because you're on EastonUniversity.com, okay? You're not, hey, how's it going? Happy Friday to you. You're not doing any of that. Hey Matt, it's Peggy calling to see if it makes sense to schedule that meeting, right? I'm calling to see if it makes sense to blank. I'm not saying thanks for taking my call. I'm not verifying who the, is this Matt? Not doing any of that garbage. Not happy Friday to you. Calling to see if it makes sense. Hey Peggy, I'm on the golf course right now. It actually does, uh, but could you give me a call Monday morning. Absolutely, Matt. Have a great round. I will call you Monday at 8.45 if I haven't heard from you before then. Fair enough? Yeah, that works. Man, that Peggy. Hey, guys, this Peggy that called me, she's on it, right? Just be skillful, but stop with the rules of it's too late. And I do this myself. We spend a gajillion dollars for leads, and we're also closed on the weekends. So I've started to make a habit now of coming in on Saturdays and Sundays and reaching out to people. Hey Peggy, it's Matt Easton, founder of Easton University. Wanted to reach out to you personally, make sure my people got you all the information you needed. I'm on my mobile, 720-660-3202. I closed four deals on Sunday. People were like, is this really you? You called me on Sunday? Wow, you really care about things. Am I asking you guys to work on Sundays? If you want, I'm not asking you to do anything you don't want to do, but I brought my business a lot of revenue by simply not having that rule of it's Sunday, I'm not going to call anybody, and just leaving a skillful voicemail. Okay, I left eight of those. Four people called me back. Of the four that called me back on a Sunday, 100% of them signed up for our sales coaching. And I bet if we went and surveyed them, they would say, Wow, I can't believe the founder of the company took the time out on a Sunday. So for every one of these preconceived rules, there's a flip side of that coin where it's like, wait, we could look at this the other way. 